Greetings, welcome to this new video about dependent source circuits analysis. Solve the problem number 8. Let's consider the transistor amplifier circuits consisting of four resistors labeled R1 through R4 along with one independent voltage source Vs. Additionally, we can observe the presence of dependent sources, especially a voltage controlled voltage source and a current controlled current uh, source. The question now is to calculate the gain Vx over Vs. Let's move on to the solution. We are going to apply the mesh analysis to solve this uh, problem. First, let's begin by defining the number of meshes in this network. It's evident that there are three meshes. This is mesh 1, mesh 2 and uh, mesh 3. And now let's proceed to assign the mesh currents in this network and I will consider I1 is the current in mesh 1, I2 is the current in mesh 2 and I3 is the current in mesh 3. All the currents are chosen in the clockwise direction. Let's start first with mesh 1. By applying Kirchhoff's voltage law in mesh 1 we can write negative v Vs plus R1 I1 plus R2 I1 minus I2 is equal to 0. If we continue simplifying this equation, we obtain negative Vs plus R1 plus R2 multiplying by I1 minus R2 I2 is equal to 0. Let's move on now to mesh 2. By applying Kirchhoff's voltage law in mesh 2, we can write R2 I2 minus I1 plus R3 I2 minus Vx over 1000 is equal to 0. If we continue simplifying this equation, we obtain negative R2 I1 plus R2 plus R3 multiplying I2 minus Vx over 1000 is equal to 0. Let's move on to mesh 3. We can see here in mesh 3 that I3 is equal to negative 50 Ix. And according to Ohm's law, I3 is equal to Vx over R4. So equation 3 and 4 gives Vx over R4 is equal to negative 50 Ix. That means we can write Ix in terms of Vx is equal to negative Vx over 50R4. And if we look back to in mesh 2, we can see here that I2 is equal to Ix. That means I2 is equal to negative Vx over 50R4. And I will call this equation 5. Now by substituting 5 in 1, we just need to replace I2 with its expression which given in equation 5. We all derive one equation is in terms of I1 and uh, Vx. Let's move on now to equation 2. And from equation 2 we can write I1 is equal to R2 plus R3 over R2 I2 minus Vx over R2 multiplying by 1000. And I will call this equation B. By substituting now 5 in B, we derive one equation in terms of uh, Vx. Or we derive the expression of I1 in terms of uh, Vx. By combining now the two terms multiplied by Vx, we obtain I1 which is given in ex ex by expression C. Now by substituting now C in, in A, we derive one equation in terms of Vs, Vx and the resistors. And if we continue simplifying this equation by combining the two terms containing uh, or multiplied by Vx, we obtain finally the gain expression Vx over Vs. Let's move on to the numerical application by replacing the resistors with their numerical values. We obtain 
the gain expression Vx over Vs is equal to negative 57.14. After completing the calculation, we conduct a simulation using SPICE to verify our results. Now let's proceed to the SPICE environment. Here is our network drawn in SPICE simulator. We can see here that this is, is the independent voltage source Vs, resistor R1, R2, R3 and R4. And we have here the voltage controlled voltage source and the current controlled current source. I, in order to verify our result, let's consider for example Vs is equal to 1 volt. That means from here from the gain that Vx is equal to Vs multiplying by negative 57.14. That means we need to obtain Vx is equal to negative 57.14. If we go to analysis, DC analysis, calculate nodal voltages, we can see here that Vx is equal to negative 57.14. If we change, for example, Vs 2 volt that means we need to obtain Vx is equal to negative 114.28. If we go to analysis, DC analysis, calculate nodal voltage, we can see here that Vx almost negative 114.28 volt. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any question, do not hesitate to contact me by email or leave a comment under this video and I will answer you as soon as possible. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and share. See you next time in another video. Take care and bye bye.